Thank you for your ongoing support by listening and sharing this podcast, as well as those who were able to recommend speakers for the show. Since our AAPI series in May, we have launched our first continuing education course and will gradually roll out more towards the end of this year and early next year. This month, on September 15th through October 15th, we are celebrating the rich and diverse cultures of Latino communities in the United States. We will actually be exploring the amazing contributions of Latinx psychologists, and thus we'll have more episodes with Latinx representation. Before we get into the episodes for this month, I would like to share a brief history of Hispanic Heritage Month with information pulled from multiple sources online. These sources will be listed in the show notes. In 1968, President Lyndon B. Johnson designated the week of September 15th as Hispanic Heritage Week. This week marked the Independence Days of several Latin American countries, including Costa Rica, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, Nicaragua, and Mexico. Then in 1988, President Ronald Reagan made Hispanic Heritage Week a month-long observance from September 15th to October 15th. This expansion was a big step in recognizing the rich and diverse heritage of Hispanic and Latino people. So in terms of notable historical moments in psychology, Dr. Martha Bernal was one of the first women of Mexican descent to earn a PhD in clinical psychology in the United States in 1962 from Indiana University. She was a leading advocate for multicultural psychology and helped found the National Hispanic Psychological Association, NHPA. The NHPA was one of the first organizations to support the creation of Hispanic Heritage Week, another important figure in psychology. In 2011, Dr. Melba Vasquez became the first Latina to serve as president of the American Psychological Association. She's a leader for cultural diversity in psychology and helped to create the APA's ethnic and race and cultural affairs portfolio, both of which are responsible for promoting the understanding of cultural diversity and its impact on psychology. There are countless other Latinx psychologists who have made significant contributions. Our goal as part of the Hispanic Heritage series is to highlight the amazing everyday work that Latinx psychologists are doing. Finally, thank you for listening. Please share and subscribe to the podcast, People of Color in Psychology. You can also follow us on LinkedIn. This episode was produced by the Multicultural Counseling Institute. Special thanks to our psychology intern, Anushka Parag, for drafting the history of Hispanic Heritage Month and including the works by Drs. Martha Bernal and Melba Vasquez. And I am your host, Jack Zinn.